<laughs> Ooh, Franklin's calling. Franklin, buddy, what's up? Hey, look, there's these redneck dudes been looking for you, homie. Some angry motherfuckers. I found where they stay, man, and I've been following them. Okay, well, it's gotta be the O'Neill brothers. <laughs> What's left of them? I'll pick up Michael and we'll come to you. T, hey, man. What's this, what, let's what's, do it. We'll do what? You piece of shit. Screw your shit. You're a piece of shit. Whoa, well, guys, I didn't do anything to you. What? You shit. Oh, All I did was walk outside. Now they want to beat the shit out of me. What did I do to them, Tom? I mean, to be fair, Trevor yeah. is a piece of shit. How do you know? I mean, a large body of evidence pretty much every time he's appeared in this game. I don't know how they knew spent. that, but. Yeah, exactly. There's, that's, that's the point I was trying to make. Oh god, the police are after me. He probably, like, killed one of their brothers or something. <laughs> At some point in the past, Trevor It's not was a big gone. deal. Remember when you killed, like, that entire biker gang? It's true. It's just, that's just another day for Trevor. Hello, no, sir. No. I would like to purchase some I weapons. I involved in your legal troubles. Some you guns for fun? No, oh, well, he doesn't want to I... sell to you when you've got cops on you. Well, then we'll, I'll read this text message from Lester while the cops leave. I've made most of your arrangements for the Polito score. All we need is that military hardware so you can move on the convoy when you can. Con oh, snap. There's a somewhat dynamic event here, Tom. There's a convoy that moves in and out of our uh, game world. You'll see oh. right now it's down here. and It's going to keep on driving up this road. You gotta intercept it. Why is Martin calling me? Trevor! Martin! You abducted his wife? You know, I've been thinking about it. I'm not quite sure if I'm ready to accept an apology. Where is my wife? Patricia doesn't want to speak to you. And frankly, neither do I. I will find you! Okay. Well, I'll put some coffee on then. I'll see you soon. Trevor doesn't sound like he's scared of Martin. No, he doesn't. I, get away from I would be scared. I would be shaking me in my little space boots. I would personally. if I was me, but if I was Trevor, I don't know. I don't know. He's like, <laughs> remember in the first like 10 minutes of this game, he wiped out like two gangs. That's fair. What kind of what, what kind of parachute should Trevor get? He's a seaside stripes, red, uh, blue is the, the default. I think the patriot shoot. Patriot obviously. shoot. All right yeah. then. A smoke trail, make it fancy. Go red or red or blue to go with this patriotism. You can't have red, white, and blue for a smoke trail. I, I guess Alternating. not. Alternating. No. Nope. It's insufficiently patriotic, Trevor? but let's go with blue. Or no, we'll oh, go with nice. red. Go with red. Duh. All right. Blue will just blend in with the sky. See, Tom, you're thinking ahead. So if I like there's it. there's clouds already and blue sky, a little bit of it at least, then the red will add the patriotism. <laughs> That's right. It'll be beautiful, Tom. You set this up in advance, didn't you? With your mind. Use my mind powers. <laughs> I'm buying up everything I can right now as Trevor. If we're gonna go steal like a military right convoy or something, probably yeah. a good idea to stock up. $130,000, not exactly flat broke. No, we got a little bit of cash. Not, not enough. Not enough to retire off of either though. No. Absolutely not. I should have put on my helmet, Tom, but it's too late. I'm impatient. So we're going to just go get this heist setup mission on. You're a monster. One day the FCC is going to take down this entire walkthrough for this. Because of not wearing a helmet? Yep. How irresponsible that is? Yep. Oh, is this for irresponsibility? Yeehaw! This is Woo! less responsible. Oh! Definitively less responsible, I would say. It's so irresponsible that they should just arrest me now. Yeehaw! I'm letting the inner redneck in me come out now. Woo! Stop that. Stop <laughs> that. You're from Minnesota. <laughs> Southern Minnesota. Oh shit, he's right. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Sorry for everybody that lives in Southern Minnesota who I've offended. You know, it's not my fault. You're from the Rochester area. It's where you are. I, I, I know. It's you specifically. There. Yeah. That's <laughs> Woo wee! I am gaining some speed on this bad boy. 
I didn't use a GPS marker or nothing. I was just like, what? Drive a straight line. Intercept the military hardware. Okay, working on it. Excuse me. Minnesota's a really good place. Like, speaking of the, the dirty cops in this mission, Minneapolis police are actually now all going to wear cameras on them. <laughs> That's which, good. Which is good. Whereas other, you know, Ow. worse, worse states, I'll just use the term, what? have made it illegal to videotape police officers. That's, the police officers no. in, Minis in Minneapolis now. That can't be. That's gotta be illegal. Illegal you... for it to be illegal? Yes. No, there's definitely states where it's illegal to videotape a that police is officer. Bullshit. Tom. Yeah, it, it is. And that's like Minnesota's like, hey guys, this is how rational fucking human beings would deal with this entire issue is they just put the goddamn cameras <laughs> on the police officers and videotape everything that they do. Same thing as a dash cam for cops. Yeah. And then it's like, you know what, if you want to be a crooked cop, it's going to be difficult because there's now going to be evidence of everything you do and you're going to have to account for the fact that your Until camera was turned that off. that evidence if it was. goes missing. Yeah. I mean, I'm sure it'll happen. I'm sure cops will find a way of, you know, destroying the recording of stuff where they're doing evil things, but they're at least going to have to find a way of working around that, you know? <laughs> There'll be some short-term gains. Yeah, it's it's not perfect, but I'm sure that it will decrease the rate of <laughs> police corruption. These, these the, guys are still following me. Yeah. The the price tag on it was like for the entire police force of Minneapolis, it was like in the like around a hundred and fifty thousand dollars, which seems super expensive, like for four hundred cops. But at the same time they had to deal with like six million dollars of lawsuits against the police department the year before. And they're thinking if they see any decrease in that, it'll be worth it. I was say these guys are murdering me, Tom, and I yeah, can't be having that. Seems like the time for a rocket launcher. You should maybe okay. shoot the people with the guns though. You know, I thought they'd all stay by their cars, like good people, but no. They're just they haven't Still. developed a relationship and a bond with their cars Whoa. the way that you did with the Pikachu car. Shoot the guy that's closest to you. Trevor! Who the fuck is over here? Where are you, sir? Why are you hiding behind that truck? That is my truck. Thank you very much. Jeez. Just disrespect me to use your truck for cover like that. It is. No. There we go. Whew. Headhunter. Gotta do what I do. Oh, Murder you could have used people. sticky bombs. That would have been cool. Yeah, I could have. Like, I don't understand. Like, I would have. I stopped the convoy, and then I would like take out a sticky bomb without them noticing it and planting it on these cars. I don't understand. Yeah, yeah. it's just a little unlikely. Like, bro, we got ourselves yeah. some military hardware. It's parked out back in my office. Okay, Trevor. The Trevor. Uh, <laughs> I'll let you know when the score is <laughs> happening. Keep me in the loop, bud. That's just not exactly a nickname on the fly type of guy. <laughs> not everybody has that specific skill set, though. That's okay. No, nah, he's a he's a plotter, a schemer. Yes. Oh, I am so sorry. Oh, oh, that woman totally didn't deserve that. Uh, why? Why? The violence. Oh, it's just the violence sick. inherent in the system. It makes me sick to my stomach, really. I'm gonna go park this military jeep in my garage. I love that Trevor has a garage attached to his trailer. Like, who it's, does that? Who has that? It's more so a loosely held together um, construction <laughs> of sheet metal and two by fours than it is a garage, but it seems to house a car, so. Yeah, it does the job it was designed to do. So, we got another Trevor mission here. Let's go do it, Tom, I'm excited. Oh, Whoa, my. our place was clean. What? What in God's uh, name is happening? What the? Yeah. Hey, Jimmy, it's your dad. Listen, if you get this, can you give me a ring? Tell your mom, too, will ya? And Tracy. Please, son. Your daddy's been a bad boy. Uh, please, son. <laughs> you want a sniff? What the fuck is wrong with you? Is that cat? <gasps> yep. <laughs> now, see, the way I see it, this country was built by and for gasoline. So I'm just trying to prove my patriotic duty by, you know, doing this stuff. Oh, man. It's cheap, but it's good. Gasolina? No. <laughs> <laughs> I love her. Sorry, Mrs. M. Jesus. 
Mikey, you want a beer? Oh, shit, I'm sorry I don't have any low car. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> Where'd you two go when you went out, you and your boyfriend? Why do you care? I don't care. Just trying to conversate. Well, I was out putting some people in their place. Ah, you know, there's more to this gig than just going crazy all the time, killing everyone in sight. Just because I like the life and you feel guilty about it doesn't make you more of a man than me. And you know what? Deep down, I know you believe the bullshit, the picket fences, the fucking happy endings. And your street philosopher bullshit, that's gotten you real far. Oh, yeah, you've achieved perfect balance. Balance? <laughs> you've gone. Man, ten years in the sun, your brain has melted. You, you say words that have no meaning. What is balance, huh? Huh? That I fucking kill only on the weekends. So Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays, I'm doing yoga and meditation. Tuesdays and Thursdays, hookers and sticking up joints, huh? You call me mad? Fuck, compared to you, I'm the sanest motherfucker I know. <laughs> oh, yeah, oh. sane, 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 oh, okay. sane. I am so fucking sane that I should open a fucking mental health clinic. <laughs> okay, yeah. Yeah, fuck, now you're gonna stop being an asshole? I don't know, but I'll try. Well, that, I like your honesty on. If he asked me the question, I would tell him no. I'm not going to stop being an asshole. I uh, spoke to Franklin. Why? It's a decision. Unlike you, the lifestyle yeah, he choice. Hears that his exactly. homie's having trouble, right? And he has no problem coming to help. So you're ensuring that we lie low. Out here, by calling LS and inviting a known accomplice of ours you know to what? come out here, what? For a little visit? That is so fucking typical of you. So typical. You don't even ask about the trouble. You instantly think about yourself. You're right. I did do that. I apologize. It's not good enough. I'm leaving, huh? I might die. I hope you're happy. Right. Hey, I'm coming with you. No. Yes, I am. No. If nothing else, then to get out of this fucking dump. You're not going. Have fun, boys. Oh, I'm going. Make sure you don't. Don't fuck stay it up. out too late. I love that woman, Tom. I think I'm gonna marry her. She's just mother handing it up for us. <laughs> I, I think, yeah. I, I might be attracted. So what is Franklin now. doing for you anyway? Tailing some guys, Gasolina. Mikey. No. Gasolina, Tailing. No. What's? Oh God. Out of body experience, Tom. What's going on? Ah! We've attained ah! oneness with the consciousness of the entire greater Los Santos area. <laughs> oh my God! What is, He's wow. back to Sandy Shores. Why did hey. you hear about it? God damn it! It's the O'Neill brothers. Shit. They see us, man. We gotta stay on. And Franklin's got chop in the car. Hey, O'Neill brothers, come here. I got something for you. Are you can throw grenades from the car? Yeah. I never no, knew. Chap. We can't deal with them yet. It's too many of them. No micro SMG? I don't want to actually kill them yet. Oh, okay. I just want to scare them a bit. Hey, man, me and Chop on these punks. We're coming up to WH, north of Chuma. Miles. All right, all right. The O'Neill brothers are coming to us. I think they was about to send one of them anti-tank rockets into your Vespucci condo when one of your roomies told them that you was gone. Okay, so if you're on the WH, that means you'll be coming through Ratton Canyon, right? Shit, I guess. Good. Me and MT are going to take the company chopper and meet you there. Well, the fuck are these chopper. guys going? Oh, damn. Michael, what? They took a little this detour. Bitches, motherfuckers. Ow. Oh, right off. Frank, you still there? Yeah, yeah I'm just here. about holding on to the road. We're taking the chopper and we'll head you off. Deal with these business stealing pricks on the road. Hey, dog, can you, like, get on it? Because these dudes is rolling hard. We're five minutes out from the chopper. All right. All right. Take care of them. Do I have to murder them? Now I'm confused. I don't think I'm supposed to murder them. I'm just supposed to try to tail them. Yeah. Fucking oh, hell! Oh! Hell. Well, shit, shit, shit! That deer helped me out, Tom. Alright, O'Neill brothers, where you going? Don't run away. I wanna talk. If your car's on fire, You're running away from it's a pretty good idea. Go get him, boy! Go get him. Do it. Yeah. Who's your good boy? What oh, is Franklin shit. wearing right now? Oh, I'm getting a phone call. It's a white running suit. Trevor, man, shit, you there? There was a deer in the road, man. These motherfuckers crashed out. They crashed. They dead? No, they gone. 
They ran into the fucking woods, man. I need air support like right fucking now. Oh, oh it's happening again, Tom. I don't I'll have just... any control. You need to just take fewer hallucinogens or cut back on the meditation <laughs> or whatever you're doing. <laughs> it's causing these experiences. I don't know if I can do all that. Where is just a road? Oh, no, don't worry. Incoming! We I'm coming! In. That's what he said, just backwards. That was like Yoda style. Totally Incoming? Hire me for Man, the you're all business. Uh, yeah, well, really this good. is kind of important. Here she is, the Biz Alley. Remember, she ain't mine, she's the company's. <laughs> <laughs> it looks nice. TP Enterprises, right on the side of it. Yeah, ah, look at it. It's very professional. Very professional. <laughs> Ah, we're now. Look, why do these guys, the O'Neills, want you dead anyway? There was a deal. A contract to end all contracts. Serious multinational stuff. I was this close. Then they stole it off me. Ho -ho Hold up. If they stole your business, why do they want you dead? Wow, ah, what's with all the questions? Can't you just take my side for once? Hey, I'm coming along for the ride, ain't I? Yeah, but I sense your heart ain't in it. Yeah, I'm lucky my heart ain't in a pie on your kitchen table. Always with the quips. You're such a depressing cynic. Oh, poor Trevor. I'm sorry I'm a human being with thoughts and feelings and emotions. Wait a second. I remember this chopper. We used this to break into the IAA building. You stole it from the FIP? Not so! I took it in lieu of payment. There was a rifle on board too, so if your panties... Hey, hey! Yeah, something we about panties. Just something about his Them panties. Big dudes in the woods. I don't know. I'm sure Mike that was lovely That model's fitted with panties. a thermal scope. Look for their heat Holy. signatures. Shit, that's a lot of things. With heat signatures. That's a lot of deer. Gotta look for something somewhat human-shaped. And what are you doing oh. out so late? Apparently one of them is actually waiting a around in the shallows at some point here in this mission. Oh? Yeah. Well then. I think I got one oh. of them. Oh, there's a guy in the creek over here. <laughs> oh, he ain't in the creek no now. more. Well, he's still Just one poor dead. soul remaining. Not this time, Padno. Wait, down south of you. Down south of you. Franklin, so I flipped off the thermal scope on that. Oh, there's a Bigfoot. Human. And then it's gone. It's gone! What the fuck, Bigfoot? That's right. Holy shit, Tom Molly freaking me out, man! Oh! Oh, what the fuck? Oh, that's not good. Oh, Tom, you distracted me with your Bigfoot. It was worth it. Let's do this, little homie. Fine. Go get him, Chop. Go. I hope we don't run into Bigfoot while we're out here. That would be bad. Uh, That'd be awesome. Frank, you wanna do me a favor here? Find him before he blows me to pieces. Don't I'm worry, following man. Chop. This. Chill. I can only do so much. If you swimming, I am too. Fuck. All right, Chop. Are we this swimming? Water is cold as a motherfucker. Oh, oh, so cold, Tom. Was it just me or did Franklin say oh. the water was cold as a motherfucker like before he got into it? Uh, is it because I jumped? I was supposed to jump. I broke oh. the immersion. Oh. You no. Know, let's, uh, what do, you, what, what do you say we use for this guy? Fists, be a man. No, no, probably not fists. Probably, he has our grenade launcher or a rocket Assault launcher rifle, or something. probably Assault pretty good. rifle. How about a carbine rifle? You sure? Got a grip and a flashlight and a scope. What's wrong with these rockets? I'm Hear coming that for you. He's closing in. You ain't getting this, O'Neal, brother. Yeah, yeah, we are. I'm here to help. What? What? Oh! Totally, he's on my map, but I didn't see him. Oh, yeah, there he is. Hey, sir! There he is! Get that motherfucker! Whoops. Last guy's done, homie! Alright! I want the rocket launcher. Stay there! We'll come down and pick you oh, up! Success? Yeah. Woo! Now we're gonna hop into Trevor and pick up Frankie Boy. Ah, didn't do too shabby there. We're gonna put chop in a chopper. 
I like it. All right, now that the angry hillbillies with rockets are dead, is there anyone else we should worry about trying to kill you? Oh, sure. Yeah, there's some bikers, the Chinese, Madrizos people, but whatever. Don't act like you're so popular. <laughs> All aboard! Man, Chops is totally cool with jumping into this yep. helicopter. That was a badass. Look, no, no seatbelt, just sitting up. Chopper's a gangster dog, all right? Oh, gee. He's not worried about falling out of this helicopter. You know, no, no. Gravity yeah. fears oh, him yeah. too much you to yank him out of here. But you can't afford to move out of that corrugated metal death shack. So how you guys <laughs> doing? Well, we're alive. Hey, good work down there. I'm the one who says thank you. He was helping me. Thank you, Franklin. Yeah, it's cool, homie. And thank you, Chop. <laughs> hey, are you going to tell us exactly what we were helping with? I know you said these guys stole some business, but that doesn't really explain why they wanted you dead. Oh, didn't I say what happened after they stole the contract? Nope, you didn't. Oh, I went to their farm and I killed a lot of them and then I blew it up. Killed a lot of them? Yes! I think that was Elwood, Walton, and Wynn who we killed just then. I killed Ernie, Earl, Dale, Doyle, Daryl, Dalton, and Dawn, and a few other guys when I blew up the farm. So, maybe this is kind of a revenge thing. I don't know. Let's not forget that I'm the wrong party here. Yeah, <laughs> you are definitely the wrong party. Oh, for sure. Um, I agree. Coming into land. Trevor was the guy who got his business taken away from him. He was just doing what he needed to do. Don't it feel good, Secure huh? Helping a friend in need. So eat Come on, chop. Come on. Oh yeah. Taking out some hillbilly crank dealers on a blood feud. That's what I live for. Hey, Trev, man, we gonna borrow this and head back to town. Sure. Come on, Michael, man. I'll drop your ass off on the way back. Chop, get in. See you back at Casa Phillips, Mike. Yeah, thanks for the warning. Whew, we did it! Past that mission, Predator, my accuracy was so good, the game doesn't even have a number for it. It looks like 40, but it's not. Totally, the game is confused, basically.